Hey guys, Kevin Miner with the Home Run Team. I just want to touch base with you. It is the first of the year as I shoot this and thought it might be nice to share with you guys some of the ideas and principles we use to be successful in our business. Hope you guys get off to a good start with your year, give you some things to focus on. Hopefully that'll be helpful to you. So the first thing is from a book we've read called Ninja Selling. You may have read it too, great book. And one of the ideas is to solve, not sell. The idea behind that is if someone has a problem or an issue and you can sell them something that solves that issue or serve them in a way with the service that solves that issue, then solving their problem is a great mechanism by which to produce sales. Um, again, you're not focusing on selling them something, you're finding out what their issue is and providing a service or a product to solve their problem. We do a little bit different take on that with us at Serve Don't Sell, same idea. But whatever people's issues are, we're in real estate, whatever their issues are with real estate, if we can find out what those are and do our best to serve them and help them to get to whatever they need to go, buy a house, sell a house, whatever it is, if we can serve their need, then we don't feel like we're selling, we feel like we're doing a good job by serving folks. So that's a big one. The second thing is, and this is out of Atomic Habits, is um, the idea is that you don't rise to the level of your goals, you fall to the level of your systems. And here's what that means. Goals are great. You should all set goals, nothing wrong with that. But if you just set goals and don't have systems in place or ways you thought about to achieve those goals, then there's a good chance you're not going to get there. So when you set goals, dig a little deeper, pull the lens back, think about, okay, the goals I've got to set with each goal that's there, what systems do I need to put in place? What things do I need to learn? What are the skill sets do I need to have to achieve those goals? And focus your time and energy on the process, skill sets. Think a little bit deeper than just writing a goal. What do I need to know to be, how to be able to do or think about or you know how do I have to structure my day to achieve the goal think systems not just goals if you can get good systems in place you're gonna find the goals are much more achievable the last thing and we say this all the time is that consistency is undefeated in any business real estate's no different there's gonna be good days and bad days some days you feel like you're overpaid this is easy my gosh I'm just so good at this and some days very much not. You think, okay, I'll sell the whole business for a shiny nickel. I'm never going to do this again. Real estate's the worst thing in the world. There are going to be good and bad in every business. That's okay. Be consistent. Show up every day. Get to your computer in the morning. Work eight hours a day. Don't let difficulty slug you down. Let failures be a, a hot burning fuel that motivates you not to let that happen again and be consistent. If you can be consistent in what you do in your efforts, if you can have good systems in place to spend your time pursuing the things you wanna get done and do all those things in a way that serves and helps people, then you can be really successful in a lot of things, including real estate. Hope this helps, hope you guys have a great year. As always, if you wanna talk anything real estate, we'd love to hear from you, reach out to us. Hope this has been helpful to you guys. Have a great year.